DJ Simmy. I'm out of town, thuggin' with my round. My coochie pink, my booty hole brown. Where the niggas, I'm lookin' for the hoe. Quit playin' nigga, cause thuggin' like bitch toe. Pound town, just left pound town. Let my nigga, he just took a bitch down. Yeah, that nigga dig a bitch down. Today I'm gonna show y'all how to get like this, period. Hey y'all, welcome back. As promised, I am filming my How to Be a Wig Influencer video. I know this is the prolonged video, y'all. I'm trying to get all my details, all my steps, all uh, everything in so I can tell y'all in detail how to be a wig influencer. So y'all, I got everything noted in my little handy dandy pink iPad. All the baddies got the pink. Let me stop. Here we are, y'all, the million dollar question. How do I become a wig influencer? Let's start off by asking ourselves, what is a wig influencer? I just Googled it and this is what it says. With the wealth of knowledge across all type of wigs and styles, these top trailblazers inform their followers about what's hot and trending in hair fashion. You can't say wig influencer without influencer part. You know what I mean? It's not just about getting free wigs, y'all. I'm sorry to say, but it's not about getting free wigs. Or it's not about, oh, pay for this wig and I'll refund you after you give me a review. No. You have to influence. I started influencing the end of December and it is now July. I'm currently at 29K on the road to 30K for the giveaway. But anyway, let's start with step one film that hair content you have to film hair content to make these hair companies attracted to you it could be wigs it could be braids it could be your natural hair it could be somebody else's hair just film hair content you have to put yourself out there in the hair industry even if you got a hundred followers 200 followers five followers y'all it do not matter film whatever content attracts the people so they can be attracted to you i started off with like probably like 5k uh, and look where i'm at now step two post i know y'all got a lot of drafted videos of y'all doing y'all hair and y'all is scared to post it be how the fuck you know this how hold on bro how influencers are not camera shy do not be scared to post it girl post 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 try to keep up with the latest trends when it comes to hair and all that stuff that will get you on the for you page and when it gets on the for you page and people like your video and they're like hmm i like how she did that or hmm i never seen her before mm hmm i like this wig mm hmm where you got that wig from girl they will do follow you it's only one click of a button yeah, this is a camera. This is a camera in your room, in your space, wherever you at. This is a camera. You're not sitting here sitting in front of the 30,000 people following you. You're not, they're not all sitting in front of your face, so you should not be scared. Step three, brand yourself. And what I mean by that is your profile name and your bio. When hair companies click on your page, your page is basically like your portfolio. So they need to make sure you're not just a random person just asking for free stuff, okay? You can't, you can't be that girl, okay? So your name, what do you want them to call you? Because when they email you, they're going to say, hey, your profile name. What do you want them to call you? Your profile name can be like Big Booty Julie. They're going to be like, hello, Big Booty Julie. I want to pro... You can't... <laughs> My name is I'm the Prada Bay. They call me Prada Bay or they call me Sanaya. Now, your bio. You gotta have an email, a business email, okay? Once you got your business email, put it in your bio. They'll be able to email you. It's more professional when companies are able to email you versus like DMing you. They can really like send you stuff and their preferences, send attachments and stuff that they suggest and all this stuff. And also make sure you put that you're a wig influencer in your bio. Your name in your bio is your first impression. The second impression is your content, okay? So after those steps that I just told you, which is film hair content, post, and brand yourself. Now you're a wig influencer, period. There's nothing more, nothing less to it. It don't matter how many followers you start off with, how many followers you have. There's not a certain amount of followers you have to have to be a wig influencer. Your content and your influencing is what make you a wig influencer, okay? Next thing to know, how do you build your platform to attract more companies, bigger companies? The key thing to building your platform really is consistent posting. 
I say you can start off with once a day just to get used to it, get the hang of it. Then you can move on to twice a day or some people even do three times a day. I post like twice a day. You got to have that mindset of y'all going to see me. Y'all have to see me. When people go on your page, they need to see two things. Quantity and quality. Quantity, how consistent do you post on a day-to-day -day basis? Quality, your lighting or your videos. Let me show y'all my setup right now. I have these two lights that I got off Amazon and I even have a vanity right here. Get you a nice little ring light or some off Amazon or something of that sort. Just make sure your lighting is good and your quality is good. If you have a business, you think you're gonna want somebody that's recording off poor quality? Girl, get your phone, get your light, set up and record. We're gonna get into negotiating your rates yeah so what you can do and what i started off doing i started off doing free promos why is it good to start off with free promos because you're doing two things you're improving your work and you're getting your face out there you give them those videos that you're doing for free they're going to post it on their page then other companies are going to see you on their page they're gonna be like oh who is this person let me text her and see how much she charged so i can send her my stuff because she look good then you can start charging companies okay Hey yeah, y'all, I done gave y'all all the juicy deeds, I done gave y'all all the steps, I done gave y'all some advice. If there are any more questions y'all have, make sure y'all comment them down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I wish you guys good luck on your journeys, babe. There's room for everyone in this influencer world. Don't listen to these people, don't listen to them girls. Oh, buy my ebook and oh, buy this, buy that, and I'll tell y'all how to do it. Listen, I'm here, I'm gonna give y'all the tea. For free. Make sure y'all subscribe. Thank you guys for all the support. We are currently at 152 subscribers on YouTube. We're on the road to 300. And stay tuned for more.